<laughs> oh, we're, we're making it through. There he is, there he is. Oh, dude. Oh. There he is, buddy. He's a nice one, dude. He's healthy. She's healthy. They're nice. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm sorry, fuck. That's a big one, dude. That's the biggest one. <gasps> that was a 10 pounder! I'm so excited to bring you guys today's video because we are fishing a pond that's literally been here for a hundred years. We met this guy when we were eating dinner the other night and he literally caught what? Like four, four or five, 15 pounds. So this is an, like an abandoned trophy, little hidden trophy pond that not many people have been to, but the guy's like, you gotta go try it out. So we're about to sneak the boat through this little crevice and see if we can get into some of these trophy fish today. Beautiful grass, nasty looking banks with some laydowns. I think we're gonna catch some big ones today. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, hit the notification bell, also hit the like button. Let's go ahead and get the boat and see if we can get into the pond. For this week only for Black Friday, for every single kicking rod that you purchase on kickingtheirbass.com, you get three free packs of striking bait. So it doesn't matter if it's a bait caster or if it's a spinning combo, if you buy one, you end up getting three packs of bait. So go ahead and head over to kickingtheirbass.com. I'll link it down below. Thanks in advance to everybody for the support, but this week only, three free packs of baits with every rod purchased. Tight. This is very tight. Oh my god. It looks like we might fit. Dude, it's so tight. Can you tight. pull that post around? Yeah, yeah. Alright. Alright. Oh my god, dude. You're, you're a maniac, dude. Hey, you do what you gotta do? Oh my god. <laughs> Catch me if you This is probably the only place that we would do this at, right? Oh, yeah, dude. <laughs> Question is, how are we gonna get it back on? Great question. Now, that is a <laughs> road we will cross once we get there. Oh, oh. We're in. <laughs> oh my god, dude. We're floating, boys. All right. Time for me to hop on. Slip her on in here. The boat's floating, dude. Yeah, we're floating. Well, that's what I told you. Oh. You got it? You ready? Yeah. Let's get on in here. Okay. Let's do the dang thing. Oh, shit. This is the moment of truth, though. Can we get past this grass mat? Heck yeah, we can. All right, hold on. I'm going to turn the boat around. Can I try to spin it? So we're going nose first? Um, it's up to you. I don't want to pick up that. There's <laughs> nothing. <laughs> A million spiders. Oh, we're money, dude. We're money. This is a floating mat, I believe. Yeah. Oh, we're, we're making it through. We're getting through. Hold on. We a million spiders. Really? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. What? There's giant spiders. Oh no. Dude, look at that. Oh. <laughs> go, let you go. <laughs> oh. We're almost there. Oh, dude, it's pretty yeah, deep. Play. We'll check each other for spiders in about 10 seconds. Yeah. Oh my god, this place is saucy, bro. I feel like I almost need to like not be weighing down the back right there. Yeah. There you go. There you go. Keep doing that. I can't. I really thought you were going in head first right there. Are you moving? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going. Yeah, there's giant spiders everywhere. No. Dude. We made it. 
way out? Yeah. Oh, oh my god. god. Yeah. Dude, look at this pot. I can't believe we got through that. That was, that was ambitious. But well, we're here, wow. baby. We are here. Holy yeah, look at these spiders, bro. Look at these spiders. They're everywhere, bro. Oh my god, get out. Oh, dude. I mean, there's like a, there's literally like 30 spiders right here. Hopefully no black with us. Brown. Dude, you got one hanging from your butt. I'm not even kidding. The other <laughs> side. Wipe it, wipe it. That is the hole that we just went through. Dude, you can't even tell there's a hole there on the GoPro. <laughs> That's impressive. Okay. I can't believe we got over that mat. I wish it wasn't 35 degrees right yeah, now. Yeah, that would be great. That would be. It is really cold, guys. Our first, like, super cold fishing day of the year. We actually caught some fish earlier this morning. Fairly easy. I mean, they bit pretty good. I'm I'm thinking of chatter dawn. Like that's just my big fish confidence bait. If we're in three foot of water right here, I feel like. I'm gonna throw a spinner bait. Yeah, spinner bait would. Ooh, dude, the conditions are money for a spinner bait. I feel like we should go for some big ones, man. Yeah, dude, I've caught more big bass on spinner bait than any other lure. I'm thinking that color. Oh yeah, that chartreuse. Color's nasty. I'm gonna go like a little white rage crawl. So we are going to use the white and chartreuse thunder cricket rage crawl paired up on the kicking their best TVX loose combo. And as you guys saw at the beginning of the video, if you go down on the website, we are giving away three free packs of striking baits with every single rod purchase. We're gonna tie this on with a standard uni knot and we're gonna get to work. I'm excited. I, I just, this place looks so good, guys. I gotta move this stuff so I can stand up. My man's got the 100 year old lures for the 100 year old pond. Yeah. All right, dude. I will say this water's more stained than a lot, a lot of the water we've been fishing. The place we fished this morning, like stained. Yeah, it's, it's stained clear. It's kind of like tannic looking, like kind of yeah, brown, brownish it's not blue. Like a, it's not like a deep stain, it's just like a, it's a very light. Where there's still some clarity. This is good. I like that watercolor, especially for big bass. I like the baits we're throwing are good for big fish. What? I feel like the baits we're throwing are good. Oh, for big fish? Oh, absolutely. Skirted baits in general just produce big bites. I don't yeah. know what about it. What about it is. So guys, today conditions very cloudy, cold, very dark. It's a dark day. The water clarity, pretty dirty but clear at the same time, fairly shallow. If you guys were out here fishing this pond today, what would you guys be throwing? Fletcher's choice is a spinner bait, which I think is a killer bait for this. My choice is a thunder cricket, which is a chatter donk. And these are both really good baits to catch, you know, some big fish on. Right now we're starting off on a simple little grass edge. We're only staying about, you know, 20 foot off the bank. We might have to adjust throughout the day, maybe fish some of the middle. This place is actually really big. Yeah, it is old. I mean, it is, it's got a good bit of water to fish. It's not like it's tiny. I'm just exploring. I'm interested to see what the contour of the bottom looks like throughout this thing. Look at that drop off right there. Wow hard drop off all right you know that's a good talking point too that so you know you've been what two three foot the whole time yeah i just dropped the six nine, nine? yeah oh dude so i was about to say if that dropped to like four or five or six foot that's that's killer like when you're in super shallow water two to three foot and you drop to six that's like big time you said nine I don't know how bad Maybe like seven. dude that's huge though that's a that's a big drop yeah, off for, for shallow yeah that fish should be sitting on that heavy if you can figure out where that drops off fish that edge you for sure there's nothing in my head yeah <laughs> i don't see it found like a little there he is there he is oh yeah. dude Oh my gosh. Started out hot. Dude, worked it so slow, oh Fletcher. So God. slow. That's like a three pounder. Oh my gosh. He's, yeah, yeah. Get healthy out. fish. Healthy fish. Let's go, dude. Look at him choke it, too. Swallow oh, that. Let's thing. go, dude. Start off the video with that. I'd say a two and a half. Yeah. Look at that bite, though. Oh my Chomped. goodness. Just That's great. what you want. Chomped. That's what you want. 
Let's freaking go, Fletcher. Hey, first fish. She thump it pretty good. Trophy pond. Yeah, she. Well, you know how they eat that chatter bait. They just load up on it. Yeah. So I was working a little slow because I asked you. I said, "Is there a bug in my?" I keep thinking there's a dang spider in my hoodie. And Fletcher was looking, so I stopped my bait for a second and let it hit the bottom. I'm gonna reel this really slow, like just kind of. Glad we confirmed there's bass in here. Dude, yeah, that's that's it big. A lot better. Yeah, it does. Every time you fish a new spot, it's like, I mean, you can hear all the stories you, you want, but it all comes down to when did you catch those fish? Are they still here? Are they still here? It's, this pond's been here really that long. Yeah, that's a good start. That was a healthy one too, dude. Yeah. It wasn't like skinny or anything. That was a good fish. Still call this a did you get bit? I would still call this a pond, but it it's definitely has a good bit of size on it. And it's still small, but it's got it's a little lengthy. It's a good size. It's, it's pretty long. Got instinct right now. <clears throat> Ooh, I just got hammered. That's a big one. Really? Uh, that feels big, Fletcher. You pull good. You pull pretty good. It's a nice one, dude. She's healthy. She healthy. You're nice. Oh, dude, that's a really good one. Look. Ooh. Is that four? Yeah, it's four. Ah, that's the three. Yeah. Look at that. God, they fight good. Dude, look how healthy they are. Pond, that was on grass edge. I know that means if you get a big one, like a big and big one. Oh, yeah, yeah that. that fish is almost three pounds. Had him around the corner of his mouth. Look at that. Y'all, second fish today. Look at these fish, man. Just beautiful. Beautiful. This one, you know, the first fish came on that tree line. This one came on this little grass edge. Thank you, buddy. Those are some good fish, man. Caught two fish and they're they're both brute. Yeah, he he ate that thing. He had a really a little slow. How deep are you here? Like uh, five foot. Seven. So, I mean, I'm reeling that thing so slow. I'm gonna flip to a jig. I'm feeling. Yeah, I'm feeling. I'm feeling jiggy with it. So right now, guys, I am tying on a tour grade skipping jig. This is a half ounce, and I have a rage crawl as my trailer. And this thing is looking like it is ready to go into a large mouth's jaw. Looking like a snap. Yes, sir. I don't know, dude. For one of these giants, this is like a freaking peanut. For one of these 15 pounders, he eat about 30 of these in one sitting. Dude, if I caught a 15 pounder right now, I don't even know what I would do. I would absolutely lose it. <laughs> Everyone in a 10 square miles would hear me screaming. <laughs> yeah, look at that. Look at all this. They're like rough piles or something. Oh, he dropped it. Is that big? Yes. Ooh. That that load up looks amazing. Golly, that was dude, that load up. Awesome. Dude, that got me so pumped up. Like I, he I'm dropped it. Right he dropped it. Oh, that sucks. That the... I know I've caught two on this. I'll, I'll put it back on if I need to, but I gotta try out a big jig. I'm just I'm in the mood <laughs> it's now. Calling you. It's calling me. It is calling me. I think I might go with a black and blue since you're going with a green pumpkin. Yeah. Out something a little bit different. Actually, Fletcher, just hand me that black and blue jig next to you in that cup holder. Do you think that first load up was actually a body? Oh, yeah, that was definitely a fish. So, guys, this is the Bitsy flip that I put on. This little Strike King. Then I bit down a Rage Crawl. No, that 
the bite, yeah. That was definitely a bite, though. Mm -hmm. Snap me off. Snap you off? Snap me right off. Had some good weight on it, man. Dang. I mean, I ain't gonna sit there and say, hey, that was a 12 pounder, but <laughs> he felt kind of good. The fact that he bit me that there's two times in a row right there. Maybe that's how we need to be fishing it. Just kind of little holes. You know, if the chatterbait might be a little too fast here, but pitching that jig, you know. Flipping the edge. Yeah, yeah. I mean, he bit it twice. A little bit too. I can't believe he broke it that easy. You think it would have been like a mudfish or something? I doubt it. He could have had a fray. Yeah, I could have. When you're not getting many bites like that, it makes you wonder. I know. Especially knowing there's big ones in here. So it makes you think about it like, dang. <laughs> that wasn't one of those bites to where you feel him just go, Thunk! it was one of the bites where he just loads up on it. So like the first time he loaded up on it and then I hook set and missed him. The second time he loaded up on it and started swimming towards the boat. Dude, the ones you don't feel are the biggest ones. I know, don't say that. Hey, maybe the big ones are in this grass. We just gotta fish it slow and methodical like that. I mean, I will say the grass we did fish, we were throwing a moving bait past it and they might not be that active to come out and eat it. Y'all, you know, that was my first missed fish. Me and Fletcher both missed one on a jig. So mine broke off. Yeah, so this is the, the worst feeling. It is. That's a little bitsy flip I'm throwing Strike King. It's very basic. And I got a rage crawl on the back, but I bit it down. That see that looks like a prime big fish spot right there. <laughs> the one I did catch on the grass, it was on that little like nipple, like that little point. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like there, there's two fish on grass like there. Should be more. You had yours out, the, your bite in the middle, I had my first fish in the middle, and then two fish on grass. I think they're just kind of spread out. <laughs> oh, oh, there we go. Got him. Look at him running. Oh my gosh, there's a tiny one. <laughs> I felt him bite, and then all of a sudden I was like, dude, I have no pressure. He ran from that little pink thing all the way over. Well. He's still fat, dude. Look. Still got a little belly on him. It's definitely not what we want. Pretty colors on him, though. Looking like a future 15 pounder, if you ask me. Look at the colors on that fish. He ain't big, but that's something. That is my first fish on the jig. The one I broke off, definitely bigger than that. <laughs> All right, I think I, I got to switch back to the chatterbait, dude. It was just doing it at the beginning. I mean, I, I didn't really think I had too much on it, but now noticing that we fished almost this whole place and barely had any bites other than on this. It could be the chartreuse. This water is a little stained. I think the jig can definitely get bites. I just think a lot of these fish are roaming. You might have a better bet with something with a little vibration. I'm surprised you haven't got hit. I mean, you've been throwing that for half this lake. Or like a weightless Senko. I just, I feel like, I, I don't know if these fish are just being finicky and we're actually throwing in front of them or if there's really not that many fish and they're roaming. You know what I mean? I don't know what the answer to that is. Yeah. Because if they're actually there, I'd say we put on like a weightless Senko and just go to work. But I feel like they would have ate that jig more. Kind of got like a spooky vibe to it. Yeah, today is weird. There he is, buddy. Super slow. Same? Dude, I mean, I'm talking barely eating it, Fletcher. That's a good one, too, man. Yeah. The ones that are eating that are good. You, you got to barely reel that thing. Look at that thing. I mean, just... I'm talking, you let that thing hit the bottom and you're just barely moving it. Yeah. Look at that, boys. That's our third fish. They're all good ones, man. They're all nice, beautiful largemouth. I mean, oh my God, look at his tail, dude. Oh, that's crazy. Look at that. I've never seen one like that. I've never seen it before, ever. 
<laughs> hey, you're the lucky bass. He's a lucky bass before the 15 pounder club. <laughs> yeah, well, I can see it. You're beautiful though. I mean, just look how healthy, man. Beautiful fish. I've never man. seen a bass with a tail. Super cream, green. <laughs> That's a cool looking bass. There we go, guys. Either I just got a ton of confidence in this bait and I know how to fish it, or they're, this is just what they want. So, I mean, I haven't been throwing it much long, too, too long here. I already got another one. Yeah, Fletcher, I'm talking, hitting the ball. Look at my reel. Crawling. Dude, just crawling it. And they just load up on it. They're not slapping it. I mean, he was the subtle, the most subtle little bite. So weird. Oh, dude. Dude, I'm talking instantly. Hammered me. That was, hey, all the bites today have been slow. That was a slam. Right there, I landed. I started reeling and he freaking hammered. Oh. Got him. What in the world am I feeling? I don't know what else to push my everything off. There he Got is, him. buddy. Got him that time. He's small. That's probably why. Throw it up in there. There's gotta be another one. Look how tiny he is. He didn't put up a fight. He, hey, I'll tell you, he, he hit that thing harder than any fish today, though, Fudgy. Yeah. Look at that. Look at that. The colors on him are just so pretty, though. He's got that really nice gl glow to him. I was going to say glaze. Glaze. He's got that nice glaze, that glazed donut to him. He's he a little squirt to be eating this big old chowder donk uh -huh. here. I just hammered it, dude. Like, these dudes have been acting weird all day. Yeah. Fish. You have one. Oh! Bro, that was a good fish. Rod tip. Look at the boils. Oh, oh, there's the bite I was looking for. Dude, I got hammered too. Stay right here. That was just one. That's like good. Oh my gosh, dude, I'm talking like that bite was insane, man. That woke me up. Like that woke me up better than my alarm clock right there, dude. That sucker slammed. It's always the small ones that do that. I mean, he ain't tiny, but he ain't big. <laughs> That's <fish. laughs> That was the best bite all day, guys. All these other fish have been loading up on it. He just don't. Long two pounder. Thank you, baby. It's five fish for the chatter bait. One on jig. I forgot I caught that jig fish. No fish for Fletcher. No fish for Fletch. So, uh, for some reason, he's having a hard time today. This is last, like, last time we went out fish. I was catching him and you weren't catching Jack. Yeah. Uh, maybe you're just, uh, they're, they're saving it for the 13 to 15 pounder, dude. All my, all my weight's gonna come off of one fish. How did we just get drilled three times? Gosh! <laughs> I think pulled my swim bait all the way off. I think that was like near where you get you yeah, got. Yeah, almost exactly where I got hit. There you go, boy. That's a big and guys. I had my GoPro off. I was just resetting it when he hit it. Dude, he felt a lot bigger. He's fat, dude. Oh. Look at that, dude. Look at that fat bass. Talk about a belly. Dude, that's a freaking chunk, buddy. That thing has been eating. Oh my goodness, that's a chunk. Beautiful fell right out. We're about to get on them pretty good, guys. We've had so many bites. We're just having a hard time hooking them. It's hold funny. On, hold on, hold on. We is, <laughs> you've had a lot of bites. <laughs> I've had, had nothing. At least we found a little spot here. Yeah. I mean, we had, if we would have landed all the fish we just got yeah. bit by, we would have had more than we've had all day. A pipe and that electrical box. Shake it good up in there. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my gosh. Bro, bro, bro. It's a freaking mega. I was stuck. He's like a five pounder, dude. Yeah, 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 yeah. Can you, can you grab him? Oh, he's not that big. He's not that big. He's like, he's a good one, though. Spicy. I mean, that's, if he was a little fatter, he'd be four pounds. That would come right off the stone? Dude, I don't know what I was on, bro. 
But he like, I had to pull him out of whatever it was. Yeah, I saw your line oh. like pop. Wow. That's that was, the best one. Yeah, that's a good one. Oh, oh, did you get hit? It's all, it's all good. Throw back in there, dude. They're, they might be loaded there. We might have just fired them up. That's a freaking good one, guys. That's a good three and a half pounder. Probably the biggest one today. He's not quite four, but he's up there. He's a high three. Freaking fat belly. Thank you, buddy. Wow. Let's get back in there. Sorry, Fletcher. That's a big one, dude. That's the biggest one. <gasps> that was a 10 pounder! Bro, that was a huge fish. That was a huge fish. Oh my God. That was a oh, monster. Fletcher. Bro, that was Fletcher. a monster. Fletcher. Fletcher. That was a double digit, dude. Sorry, Fletcher. Golly. Ooh, that was a 10 pounder bro did it come out or did he snap what? dude i felt him coming up but like i know i've been a little stupid this video and i've been like oh it's a big one and it's yeah. like three pounds okay that puppy right there felt huge and i and i handled him like a three pounder dude i freaking handled i knew he was coming up if i would have known he was that big i would have i would have really fletcher that that was insane how that, big that fish was that fish was i haven't a seen behemoth. a fish that big in a year that fish was crazy. Like I'm serious, that fish wasn't ten; he's nine. That, the the body, he was so he wasn't so just, wide. He was just yes, he was huge. How big do you actually think that fish was? I didn't really see it that great. Right, that was a ten pounder. You really think it was that big? Fletcher, that was a dude. I saw it. That fish that I caught, this. It, I'm curious to know if it's the same day, but dude, it, it was like that fat. Like yeah. it was that wide. Just bro, it was huge. I just kind of saw the splash out of my peripherals. I guess the rumors are true. <laughs> I guess that, that was a fish. I guess the old man wasn't lying. It looked good. There's one. Finally, Whoa! finally. Gosh, you little sucker. Finally caught one on the jig. And it's a behemoth, dude. Get your, get your weight up, boy. Get your weight up. <laughs> a long day for a little fish. Guys, Noah's over here smoking me and, you know, loses a giant 10 pound bass potentially. You know, it couldn't even have been bigger than that. It's just so hard to tell once they get to that size. They just, they're freaks. They get, yeah, they're crazy. They're freaks. There's one. Wow. Whoa, 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 whoa. Good size, good size. Hello, hello. Turn it on here at the end of the day for me. On the jig. Yeah, it's a good size fish. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, I'm recording, boy. That's Dude, a I'm a nice fishing one. YouTuber. I'm always recording. Look at that. Let's go. That's a, nice that's a good one. one. That's one of the best ones. Three that's one of the best ones so far today. I'll take it. Bro, Fletcher, there's some big ones in here. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah, there are. <laughs> Golly, she cranked that sucker, too. That's a that's a healthy fish, man. Right on that grass one? Yeah, just r right over here. Or maybe they're turning on. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. That's two on the jig right there. Finally. Well, Y'all, I hope you enjoyed this video. It was a crazy day. I mean, it was cold. It was tough. The chatter bait was definitely the bait. I lost that freaking monster. And I, I haven't hooked a fish like that in 363 days. <laughs> yeah. uh, it was almost dead on, dead on the date of when I caught that 10.49 last year. And I promise you that that fish right there was every bit of that. If he wasn't, he was way bigger. I mean, that, that was a massive, massive fish. And I was playing around with him like he was a four or five pounder. Like I wasn't really snapping into, hey, this place has a lot of potential. And uh, at least we know now. And uh, we're going to come back with the right weapons next time, hopefully on a great day and catch some really big fish out here. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Hit the like button if you did. Share this video with a friend. I'd really appreciate it. And I'll catch you all in the next video.